you. Time to check in with Sherry Beeks, who's all aglow in Hamilton Hill this afternoon. Hi, Sherry. <laughs> Hey there, Tevo. Well, you know I'm out looking for the coolest things to do around Perth this weekend. And, of course, I'll be giving away some tickets to it as well. Uh, but how gorgeous has this weather been? You're going to need to find something to do indoors this weekend because showers are on their way. But let's take a quick look at today's conditions. And under those clear skies last night, we did dip to a low of 5.7 degrees. And with all that sunshine, though, we managed a top of 20.8. Uh, mid this afternoon. Now it will be even warmer tomorrow Trace but you will have to soak up that sunshine while it's here and uh, I'll have your weather details coming up shortly but I'll let you know what I'm doing and it's not baton twirling. No. I'm very good at it. I'm fascinated. It's unfortunate that it's not. <laughs> <laughs> Can't wait to see more of it. You're doing very well Ooh, so yeah. far. All right, Sherry. We'll chat to you soon. Thanks so much. We'll change of pace now. We're going to see what's on in Perth now with Sherry Biggs in Hamilton Hill. What's happening there, Sherry? Oh, wait, <laughs> Some baton twirling. Tracy, no, I'm just kidding. This is actually used for hitting balls. And I'm just finding out another skill that I'm not very good at, and that's mini golf. But I'm here at Glowing Rooms in... Oh, see? <laughs> in Hamilton Hill and it's Perth's newest and coolest attraction and I of course have the creator of all this craziness right here with me Ben Herzog. Now Ben this is a 3D room hence the glasses so the walls are actually jumping out at us. What led you to create this craziness? So I've seen this about like two years ago in Germany and I was I'm always a big fan of mini golf and I've played this 3D idea and I was like I've got to, got to try this and people are just so stunned when they walk in like how it pops off the wall they want to touch it and it's just awesome to take people in the first room. Well I've seen a 3D movie before but how do you actually get this on the walls? Yeah so we've flown over two artists from Germany and they spend a thousand three hundred hours just painting everything by hand right with wow. a special color yeah. with a special technique and with those glasses you see everything pops out so it's really just three elements that make it work if only one thing was messed up it wouldn't work and is this for all ages uh, from the age of five, it's not really suited for younger, but from the age of five to 100 or 110 or 120, male, female, they all love it. But it's brilliant like for team building and people just come down, have a good laugh and really have a great time. And just quickly, this is just the beginning for glowing rooms. You've got a whole future planned for them, don't you? Yeah, so we've got a lot more planned on this premises, like escape rooms, but in virtual reality. So I've got a, the rooms already set up, so we just need a probably a few more weeks or a few more months and a few more people through the mini golf. And then that's the next thing that I will do on the premises. There's still so much space here and um, potentially, yeah, looking at the, another site north of the river. Very cool. Well, I'm looking forward to that, Tebo. I think I've got us covered <laughs> for the weekend. But here's what else is on around Perth. Now, it's, of course, August today. And that kicks off Muddy Puddle Walks Month as well. So you can make like Peppa Pig, everyone's favourite, and organise your own Muddy Puddle Walk all while raising funds for Save the Children Foundation. And for the mums and dads, tomorrow is the international celebration of the oldest man-made drink in the world. Beer, of course. Microbrewery, the island at Elizabeth Key, has some special offers to pair with your brew. But if beer is not your taste, what about Pinot? But uh, Pinot Palooza is on at the Claremont Show grounds this Saturday. Taste the very best Pinots from Australia, New Zealand and beyond, all with live music and plenty of yummy food as well. And Tebo, if you and any of your friends or anyone else in the audience would like to try this crazy cool golf here at uh, Glowing Rooms, then how many are we giving away? We're giving away four double passes at nlp at nine.com.au. So just send us an email and they could be yours. They'll be flowing in. All right, Sherry, we'll leave you there to enjoy <laughs> it. To we'll improve. chat to you soon. <laughs> well, time to head to Shirley Biggs with the latest weather. Almost yeah. time for the weekend, Sherry. <laughs> yeah, sorry, we're having too much fun here. <laughs> it's a pity, though, that we're not getting today's sunshine over the weekend. We do have a cold front on the way, but I'll have all your weather details coming up next.
Welcome back. Well, I'm here at Glowing Rooms in Hamilton Hill. Now, this must be the coolest mini golf in Perth, and you'll certainly need something to do indoors this weekend because conditions are taking a turn. Now, we have been soaking up the sunshine all week, though. It helped us get to a top of 21 degrees today, just before 4 o'clock, and it's still lovely in the city, hovering just under 19. Now, we have a gorgeous end to the working week ahead. More blue sky tomorrow and a top of 24 degrees. Showers coming through on Saturday afternoon, becoming heavier overnight, adding two to six mil in the gauge, 22 degrees. Showers will roll in Sunday morning. Another cold front will come through late on Monday, leaving up to 10 millimetres behind and possible storms in the southern suburbs. So Trace, it might be looking a little grey this weekend, but if you want some colour, glowing rooms is the answer. And I, uh, we're giving away those four double passes. So remember, NLP at nine.com.au and they could be yours. It looks too much fun there. Oh, it's so good. <laughs> we'll, we have a, we'll, have a, we'll have a weekend session. Don't you worry <laughs> about that, Sherry. All right, chat to you soon.